Welcome to Elevation Rewind. I'm Cassandra Ferguson. And I'm Placida Braswell. And we are gathered together today to talk about being filled. But before that, we're going to hear from Michelle Bowman Music. Here is Michelle Bowman. We're back. Thank you, Michelle Bowman Music. We have Beautiful. with us none other than the visionaries of Dominion TV, mm -hmm. Joseph and Lynette Dotton. Pastor. Doctor. Yes. Doctor Joseph Dutton. Yes. Servant of the Most High God. I know that's right. <laughs> Let's just keep it simple. Yes. <laughs> now, we want to talk to you guys about Habakkuk, actually 2.14, where it says, for the earth shall be filled with the knowledge of the glory of the mm. Lord as the Amen. waters cover the sea. Yeah, Beautiful yeah. word. Mm -hmm. That's a great scripture. Mm. And when we How much time about, do we have? Yeah. Well, we, 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 but you know what? 24 we, minutes. Okay. About, <laughs> you know, as we thought about, you know, we started off with go ye, you know, right. um, how God is telling us to go ye into the world. And then we're ending with his knowledge shall cover the earth. And we immediately thought about Dominion TV. Yeah. And how you guys are reaching the uttermost parts of the world. Talk to us about the vision for Dominion TV. Well, first of all, Lynette and I are so thankful that you ladies had us on yes. your show. Yes. <laughs> and we're so grateful to have you in the Dominion studios right yes. here in yeah. Western Having North Carolina. We're just excited about what the Lord's doing through you and oh, through your ministry and you. what, what yes. how he's launching you out into the deep yes. and uh, big things. We just yes. call in big things oh, for this wow. ministry. In Jesus' you. name. We uh, receive it. Yes. yes. Jesus' name. You know, Thank that scripture you. is a powerful scripture. One of the things I believe we have to understand is that when that scripture, when you read that scripture, it says, the knowledge of the glory of the Lord, mm -hmm. which means there's something there that we're not aware of mm -hmm. at this moment. Yes. It's not that the glory is not in the earth. Yes. Mm. The glory of the Lord has been in the earth since God decreed Creation. over man yeah. in Eden. Mm -hmm. uh, God, uh, Genesis 1:22, and God blessed them. God said and blessed them. Mm -hmm. And then 1:28 says, "Be fruitful, multiply, replenish, subdue, and take dominion." Adam was a glory creature. He mm -hmm. was a glory carrier. That's right. Before yes, he, was. he was flesh and blood, he was flesh and glory. That's right. Which I believe that's what we're getting back to. That's right. Yes. That is why we've got Ooh. redemption. Yes. That's why we've got yes. the blood of Jesus. Right. But the glory has never left the planet. It's like right. when Christ, when Jesus left the planet, Jesus left the planet, mm -hmm. but Christ never did. That's Christ right. is the anointing, mm -hmm. the anointed one in his anointing. Yeah. And so I believe the glory is in the earth. Mm -hmm. yes, it's it only a matter of time as we go ye. Mm -hmm. go ye. <laughs> it's only a matter of time that that glory begins to be revealed, unveiled. Mm -hmm manifest, demonstrated. Mm, right. And I believe that's going to come not just out of heaven into earth. And we, right. we pray, Jesus, give us the model. Right. Pray thy kingdom come, come thy, thy will, will be, be done. done. But I believe it's, where is the kingdom? The kingdom that's of right. God is within us. Mm. And so I believe that glory is being unveiled, revealed. There's a perusia oh, of Jesus, Jesus. Oh, of the Christ. Mm -hmm. Even from our consciousness, from, yeah. from how we speak, how we think, right. and out of that we begin to create. And what happens is that manifestation of now. what's already in Preach. the earth. The knowledge Ooh, of the glory of the Lord it. begins yes. to fill the earth. Somebody have yes. the offering? <laughs> <laughs> 
isn't it? Pay pay. <laughs> 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 so speaking of which, tell us about your ministry. So we are here in Dominion Studios. Yep. Yes. Dominion TV Studios. We um, are also here um, in, in the midst of the ministry that God has given you. Talk to us about your ministry. Where did it, when did he birth it and, and all of that. Yeah. We want to know it all. Well, it's been birthed probably since, ooh, it started way back when, <laughs> you know, when we were young. He started preaching at 14. This wow. summer will be wow. 30 years wow. in full-time <laughs> ministry for me. We both wow. come from families of preachers and ministers mm -hmm. and servants of God. Um, so it's always been there. Mm -hmm. And I want to say when we were in Augusta, Georgia, God started really um, transitioning and shifting and cultivating us. And um, Genesis 128 has been our theme since we've been married. Mm -hmm. wow. yes. And and that is that is the scripture it's our foundation stone yes. um, because it's the original intent um, that God has for mankind. That's right. right. And so when you, you get back to the original mm -hmm. thing that God wants us to do and we focus on what we were here to do, then everything else that he intended starts happening, yes. which is, is, you know, the knowledge of the glory of God. Yes. And, and, and so that's so exciting. And so it's been a journey. So as we were talking just a few minutes, mm -hmm. um, as we were getting ready for the tape to start rolling, um, we were in Augusta, Georgia for almost 20 years um, as associate pastors, and we um, were the media directors there as well. Um, what associate pastor means, if you're not aware, <laughs> it means you do absolutely everything. Everything. That and, nobody then some more. <laughs> and then some more. And when you finish doing that, yeah. something There's else. Something else. <laughs> exactly. Oh, exactly. I'm aware. <laughs> so media was one of those things that we did and right. we loved, and we helped launch a television station there in Augusta, Georgia, oh, um, back when we were in our early 20s and Destiny was just a baby. Mm -hmm. yep. And um, so TV has always been in our blood. Yeah. Um, and and then, you know, so we grew up, grew out, you know, of some of that stuff, it wasn't as much of a focus. Mm -hmm. um, and God called us to Chattanooga. We were there for about a year and a half, right. which really started uh, probably the main launching of mm -hmm. um, Dominion Harvest Ministries. Yes. Right. And um, then we were called to Dallas, Texas. Mm. And I think that was really a stretching and enlarging time for us. And a learning period. And a us. learning period um, because we saw TV and some different things done on a bigger scale right. um, in, in the big city. Yes. And then God called us here. And I think the biggest thing when we came to this, if anybody knows about Forest City, you know it's a really small place of about 7,000 people. Mm -hmm. um, but God told us you can reach the world from Forest City, North Carolina. Wow. And I'm like, what? How? He's here. Jesus. I was back in <laughs> Dallas getting ready to pack. And right. I'm like, how God? And I started researching and I found out the Facebook data center was being built here uh. and some different things. So it was a clue. Well, if they think that there's something here, right? then, right. you know, right, right. surely we can reach some. They've got to have something here. So, so that reminds me yes. of our natural state. Mm -hmm. When we hear God, say something to us. Mm -hmm. It's almost like we need evidence. Yes. You know, we need, okay, Lord, that's big. Yeah. Right. Me? Uh -huh. Like there? You yeah. know, but he was showing you before yeah. you could even see it for yourself. Mm -hmm. This scripture, for the earth shall be filled with the knowledge mm -hmm. of the glory of the Lord as the waters cover the sea. And he wanted to do that through you. Yeah. Yeah. That's big. And you have to have the right kind of focus and vision and spiritual insight and eyesight That's to be right. able to see that. You have to be yes. able to call those things that be not, that be not, not as, as though they, they were. Are. When you mm -hmm. go into a city of 7,000 yes. people yeah. and mm -hmm. God tells you to raise up a global television yeah. station, uh -huh. <laughs> you want to call God a liar. Right, right, right. right. You but he right. is not a man that he <laughs> right, should lie. Right. That's right. Neither the son of man that he should repent. Yes. Hath he not said it and shall he not, not do, do it? it. it. He'll perform it. If he, took, if he mm -hmm. gave you the vision, he'll give you the provision, the mm -hmm. people, whatever That's else right. you need exactly. to go along with it. And so when she saw uh, on, online, I was actually, uh, I, had, I had flown back into Dallas mm -hmm. uh, with uh, the bishop that I was with. I flown back with him. And I said, okay, I've got to go do this meeting. Mm -hmm. I flew back out of Dallas and uh, went down to South Georgia, North Georgia, South Georgia. And they called me. They said, can you come to Forest City? I said, yeah, mm -hmm. I'll come. They said, well, we want to talk to you mm -hmm. about taking over this, this work. Hmm. Well, the first time I'd preached here in this, this, this city, there was over 250 people in this church. 
I said, yeah, when I got here, it was 18 people left. Wow. And, uh, but she you said, thank you, God. <laughs> it, yeah, it was like she saw, she saw Facebook is here. So Facebook, the data center for Facebook, where everybody in the world sends a message through Facebook, right. loads a picture, it comes through our city. And it was like God telling me, I'm going to cause the nations to come into your city. Amen. It don't matter how many people you got here. Right. You can right. be on the back side of the desert and God will cause a bush Absolutely. to talk to you. Absolutely. You, you can be out in the wilderness. Mm -hmm. uh, John the Baptist was out in the countryside uh -huh. crying, repent for the kingdom of heaven. And everybody in the city came to him. So God yeah. said, I'll, let, I'll cause them to land their planes in Charlotte and Greenville, rent a car and ask where Forest City, North Carolina is. Woo. And that's well, what's happened to you ladies. <laughs> That's rented a car and, and put G, you turn your GPS on. Where in the world That's is right. Forest City, yeah. North Carolina? <laughs> and, and you guys are here. And then just last week, somebody else from up the Northeast. And it's happening every mm -hmm. week. And God's we're, we're seeing it. System. And so our ministry, our church here, uh, we've been here almost uh, seven, seven years, years in summer. July. Wow. So it's building, building, building church, uh, Bible school. And now the studios, along with the television ministry, which is reaching 24-7, 24, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, around That's the world. Amazing. We're hearing people from people from uh, Pakistan, India, all over Africa, South Africa, West mm -hmm. Africa, East Africa, uh, the Cameroon, the islands uh, Fiji from islands. Trinidad, all the way to Fiji, all wow. in the islands. Wow. And then all over the United States. Italy, Spain, Ireland, Netherlands. Uh, Gutter, yeah, Qatar, whatever however they pronounce we can't it. Right? Out how what does it feel? How, speak to me about how it feels to be entrusted with such a mission, with yeah. such a vision. Well, we're holding it like a child right yeah. now, yeah, because this we launched. Even though this thing's been in our heart for many, many years, you know how vision is. Yes. You get a glimpse of it. Yes. You don't know how to start it, but Absolutely. you know, and, and you know, you know, God declares the end from the beginning. That's right. So it it's already faith. finished. Walking, walking it out, it out is You're the just problem. Walking it out. So right now we're just holding this baby, like mm -hmm. holding it like a baby, mm -hmm. and we're birthing this thing. Mm -hmm. And so we we are we are caring for it, pouring into it. Mm -hmm. We're carefully guarding it. Yes. Uh, we're we don't want to be like every home. other station. That's we don't right. want to be like every other Christian broadcast mm -hmm. station. Mm -hmm. We want to make sure that the gospel of the kingdom is first and foremost, that the, yes. the people's faith is being built. That's right. mm -hmm. and, and that as we're doing that, faith cometh by hearing and hearing by, by the, the word, word, that we can grow a whole generation of people in the mm -hmm. love of God, in the, in the fear right. and the admonition of the Lord, mm -hmm. and in taking the kingdom of God to suffer violence and the violent take it by force. A generation... Mm -hmm that's going to pursue and recover yes. and take over. Yes. Okay. And that's yes. what I want to ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Tell me what do you think the state of the church is right now? As you, Ooh. yeah. Because, <laughs> oh, Shonda. Seeing, right, that's what I'm seeing, right? I'm seeing, and I'm hearing you, you say, you talk how God gave, you know, you entrusted your wife her from God. Mm -hmm. And you said, okay, I see it. You had to see it. That's and you right. said, God, I hear you. But you ended up here, but now you are inviting people from all over the world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're from Maryland. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, we're, I met you in Atlanta. Yeah. Yes. Right? <laughs> At Dr. Cindy Trim's event. Mm -hmm. Yes. And now here we are, and that was in December. Yes. Right. Here we are in March. This March mm -hmm. still, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> here we are in March, right? Mm -hmm. And this, that one meeting has produced this. Had, right. This is mm -hmm. a manifestation. Mm -hmm. Yes. So I'm seeing the church without walls, if I can yeah, say that. Exactly. We are mm -hmm. operating fully in the church without walls. That's right. And you welcomed, you know, Lynette, you was like, Cassandra. And that gift that you guys have is incredible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So tell me, what do you think the state the church is in right now? I think there's, 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 <laughs> if I can say it this way, there's a church in the church. Yeah. Overall, I think the church is asleep. Hmm. I don't think she's going to stay that way. Hmm. I've got hope and faith mm -hmm. that Jesus That's said, it. I will build my church and That's the gates it. of hell will not, not prevail against, against it. it. And, uh, you know, that, that, that's, that's not, uh, that's not just just gates jumping off their hinges coming at us. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's that's the blockages, the hindrances, the that's mountain, the fig that's tree it. that's mm -hmm. not producing, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. That that whatever's standing in our way, I believe that the real church is going to conquer that, yeah. that's it. and we're going to see the church be the church. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. uh, not just going to church, but be the church, be right? The church. But there is a church in the church. I mm -hmm. believe there is a pioneering, prophetic pioneering right. uh, a forerunner company today that are taking, they're taking hold of life. They're taking hold of, of, of faith and authority mm -hmm. from mm -hmm. God's Word, and they're advancing the kingdom of exactly. God. Mm -hmm. You may not see them. They may be people you've never heard of. Right. They may be in pockets all over across mm -hmm. the, the U.S. and pockets across the world, but they are hearing from God. That's what the Lord said to mm -hmm. the prophet. I've got 7,000 that haven't bowed, bowed their knee to Baal. Right. You mm -hmm. know, while he's sitting there crying, we're no better than our fathers, and he's mm -hmm. up underneath the fig tree, and he's about to give up. The Lord <laughs> says, son, I've got 7,000 that haven't bowed their knee to That's Baal. <laughs> you know, while there's darkness out in Egypt, there's light in Gosha. So mm -hmm. God is raising up a church within the church. They're Each. getting it. They're seeing yes. it. That's They're it. Yes. accessing That's it. it. They, yes. they are not just waiting for something. They are something. something. They they're not mm, that's right. having revivals. They, they are, are revival. They're not yes. looking for to be healed. Yes. They, they are, are healing. healing. They're Jesus. walking in divine life. They're walking yes. in divine strength. Yes. They that's are right. the forerunner company, the point men. And some of those people, you know, when you're a point man, you're going to take the hits. That's yeah. it. Yeah. And hmm. most of those hits are going to come from inside the church yeah, as a whole. That's it. Mm -hmm. I mean, the world hates us to start with. Right. You know, that's, the we expect the, that. We expect yeah. that the enemies mm -hmm. at work in the world, yeah, right? That's right? But within the church is where we're going to take a lot that's of hits. Yes. You know, that's where your family and them and your, your pastor and them, the <laughs> yeah. people that don't believe in, in you, yeah. and the church mm -hmm. you grew up in, right. you know, yep. where mama, grandmama's buried, big mama's buried in the backyard. Right. They <laughs> are against <laughs> the movement that's happening. But that's thank it. God for ladies like you oh, and, and you. us that are seeing yes. what God is doing in the yes. earth. Yeah. And, and we're strapping our boots on, yes. packing up, getting ready that's to it. do what he's called us to do, you know. Yes. And yes. it's yes. not about, and I always tell this to our people here. Too many people in the church, you ask about the state of the church, too many people are waiting for a cataclysmic event to get them to get out started. of the earth. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jesus said, occupy till I come. That's it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Occupy. There yes. is, and that's that whole Genesis yes. 1, our theme, be fruitful, <laughs> multiply, replenish, subdue, and take dominion. Mm -hmm. That is the, the church within the church, they see something more than church. They see the kingdom. There's a difference yes. There's a between churchiness difference. and kingdom. That's right. That's yes. right. That's it. That's and so right. the kingdom folk, they're taking and possessing the yes. land. That's it. They're yes. dispossessing the enemy. That's, That's it. it. When Jesus said, boys, this is what I want y'all to do. I want you to go out there and heal the sick. Hmm. I want you to raise the dead. dead. Yes, right. Uh, you know, we can't heal the sick. Absolutely, we can. Yeah. Absolutely. Jesus can. heals, yes, but He you. gave Thank us the authority to do it. Yes. Go heal the sick. That's it. Yes. The yes. church prays for sick folk. That's right. If there's Kingdom. any sick among you, let them call. That's the book of James. Let mm -hmm. them call for the mm -hmm. elders of the church. They'll lay hands on them, anoint right. them with oil, and the prayer mm -hmm. face shall save the sick. Mm -hmm. But Jesus didn't say pour oil on them and, and pray for them. He so said he heal, heal them. them. That's, so what, said, what that's kingdom heal operation. Them. That's, that's yeah. it. And so that group of people, the kingdom operation the people, kingdom they operates. are <laughs> preaching. This is what he said. Go preach the gospel of the kingdom. Yeah. And cast out devils. Now that's what I preach. That's not just us jumping on top of somebody and saying, what's your name? Come out. Right. I believe in that. I've had that's to do right. that. That's Here, right. I've done it in Africa. I've done it in Mexico. This is the thing I believe though. We, when you cast the devil out, you are dispossessing him from every place that he set himself up in authority. Right. Mm. That right. Adam seemed to have given him. Yes. That he thinks he got from Adam. That's right. It doesn't belong to him. It doesn't. It belongs to Jesus. And Jesus came out of the grave singing, I am he that liveth and was dead. Behold, I am alive mm. forevermore. Evermore. And I have the keys of death, hell, and the grave. And then he give the keys of the kingdom to the church. Mm -hmm. And why do we have these keys? So mm. we can get into heaven? Jesus. Mm -mm. No. Jesus. Thank God we can go to heaven if we die. But there's but something happens. about this life that the We're church needs to, to get a hold of that's better now. than a better death. We that's need a right. better life. That's yes. it. Well, I want to ask you this because I don't know how much time we have, but I want you to pray for the Elevation Rewind, Elevation Talk Show, and of course me and Placida and our whole team because this is new territory. Sure. Mm -hmm. Yes. You know, this, You're forging this. Yes, yeah. this mm -hmm. is new territory. And, and what you said, is what I've been coming up against. Mm. You know, <laughs> we've been, we've been coming, coming up against. Yeah. It's a lot, you know. So I want you to pray as we close out. I want you to pray, you know, 
for us. We have, okay. Um, do we have time? We, we have time to, we oh. have time. Will, we, will you pray for us Absolutely. at the end of the show? Absolutely. <laughs> but right now I want to talk to you about the book. Well, first I want to say thank you. Yeah, thank you. I want to say thank you because I know that this is divine relationship. Mm -hmm. We, um, God has brought us to you. And he, you know, he shows you people. Mm -hmm. You met in Atlanta. It was a God moment. It was yes. a God moment. And As we were leaving. But you have to yield <laughs> yeah. to Remember it. Remember the children? Yes. The child should lead them. Yes. Proud you can do. You <laughs> are in that moment, though. And mm. you can do with it many things. Yeah. But, you, it, but to be obedient and to, and to move forward, yeah. not knowing, yeah. that's the mm -hmm. substance, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's faith. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The substance of things hoped Hope for, for the, evidence. the evidence of things unseen. That's it. So, so we didn't, I didn't know I trusted. Mm -hmm. I didn't know. I just knew what God said. Yes. Yes. And we came here and this is what happened. This is yes. the manifestation. It's the beginning and it's yeah. showing us yes. that we yielded, we listened, we heard. Oh, right. Good. And I thank, I thank you for that. Thank I thank you, you thank for you. the ministry Bless that you, you have here. Yes. But I want you to tell me about the baby sitting on the table. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's another one of your babies. Well, uh, after preaching for, since I was 14, I'm 47 now. <laughs> yeah. Um, and I should have at least five of these, but I've only got one right. printed right now. And there's, I know at least 10 or more, 10 or more in my heart. But I have developed such a strong leadership mm -hmm. uh, quality mm -hmm. in myself. Pastor Lynette is an mm -hmm. amazing leader, John Maxwell speaker. Mm -hmm. And, uh, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, <laughs> and uh, the Lord said, I want you to start writing about mantles. Mm -hmm. yeah. This book mm -hmm. was birthed from a scripture about Joseph. The Bible said Joseph rode in the second chariot mm -hmm. next to Pharaoh. So Joseph didn't mind serving somebody else's vision. Yes. When he was able to serve somebody else's vision, the Bible in the New Testament, He's Jesus, elevated. when you're able to be faithful in what belongs to another man, I'll make you ruler over your own. So can I run in this studio? You absolutely can. Because <laughs> you're about to I can to have the organ down. crank up and yeah, everything. Right. We'll call them all in. But that's what this meant. This is based on is... is accessing and taking yes, the mantle. Now, yes. one of the things, parts of this book that really hit home with me is how a lot of people want to give you this, give you their mantle after they die. Mm. Now, we, I'm talking now just maybe mm. pastoral-wise, bishop-wise, covering-wise, mm -hmm. overseer-wise. Mm -hmm. You know, y'all sit there, shut up, listen to me, wash my feet, my car, huh. cut my grass, kiss my mm -hmm. ring, and then when I'm gone, y'all fight over who you wants this. But, but yeah. real Flakes. leadership real is fathers. where you learn to serve somebody else, but those that are being served learn to serve the people Jesus. under them as well. Thank you, and Lord. so that you have to learn how to release that mantle before you're dead. That's you have it. to learn how to share what's on your life. That's it. Um, you know, if, you, if you're dead, Right. And, and, and all they talk about is how great you preach. Right. How can I nurture that which was or is mine uh -huh. that I'm sharing with you? And you are trying, like, so we have um, the millennial takeover. Uh -huh. So we have a group of young people who we are mentoring, discipling. Wonderful. To do exactly what we're doing, Beautiful. but to, towards their generation, yes. right? So because we know that there is a fire. Yes, there is. There is a group of, of young people that have the fire of God burning on mm -hmm. the inside of them and they are dying for it to get out, right? Yes. But we don't want to wait till we're dead to pass it to them. No. We are doing it right now. And you just said exactly what is in our hearts. Mm -hmm. And I just yeah. thank God for that. Yeah. That is amazing. Yeah. You're, you're releasing that mantle into them. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not just something spiritual, you know, you mm -hmm. pray over them and, you know, send mm -hmm. them on their way. Mm -hmm. no, You're it's, teaching it's, them business and marketplace yeah. and yeah. training yes. them. Train them up. Training them up. And yeah. let them make some mistakes and you're there to pick them That's up. Right. And, and, and to That's dust right. them off That's and to right. say, well, we'll do it another Next time. time. We're right. going to do it until yeah. we get it right. That's right. right. That's it. This is so good. This yeah. is so good. So we're about to. How did they get your book? Yeah. Well, the book is available on Amazon. Uh, you can download it as a uh, PDF mm -hmm. on uh, e Amazon ebook, right? Mm -hmm. Me and the PDF, right? You can <laughs> download it as a, a ebook, <laughs> or you can buy it the paperback version, or you can go to drdutton.org mm -hmm. and pick this book up. It's called mm -hmm. Ministry and Mantles. It is a training ministry book. It's about leadership DNA, you, legacy you discovery, it. and leadership development. We believe this year is the year of leadership. Let's yes. pray. Let's pray. 
-hmm. You go ahead, ladies. Lord, we just thank you for Elevation Rewind, Lord. I thank you for Placida and for Cassandra and their team, Father God. And I thank you for this divine kingdom connection, God. Yes, oh and God. I thank you, God, that as we team up and pair up, God, your word says one should put a thousand to flight and two hmm. should put 10,000. Well, there's four of us, hmm. not to mention how many are behind the scenes right yes. now. And so we should be able to take soul millions soul. Hmm. of souls Beautiful. for the kingdom of yes. God right now. And I thank you, Lord, for the new mantle that you're put, placing upon them and that you're causing them to rise and to elevate to new levels and to new dimensions, to take new territories. Now in Jesus' name, I thank you, Lord, for enlarging their tents and expanding their borders, Father. I thank you, Father, for pouring fresh oil upon their heads, God. And God, as that's poured upon them, Father, that those millennials that are around them, those younger, that, that they'll be mentored and that anointing will flow Yes. Hallelujah for yes. mothers to daughters. Yes. Hallelujah in Jesus' mighty name. I thank you, Father God, that you're going to take this show, take this message, take this radio show, and their voices across the nations. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Significantly, Jesus. Father, and that they will have something of legacy and significance that will remain in this earth. Hallelujah. 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 Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In Hallelujah. the lives of these people that are being touched. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' Amen. name. Amen. 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 This has been another episode of Elevation Rewind. Thank you. <laughs>